Welcome to our channel www.news.co.id Hey, what's up guys? Me with me again in New CNC channel. Okay, in this tutorial, I'm gonna show how to import Microsoft Excel to Data Grid view in Visual Basic. First, we need to create one project here. Let's do to create a project. I will put my project into desktop and then give the name is import excel into data grid view vb.net okay then I click ok before we decide to code I want to explain shortly if in this tutorial we need Microsoft Office installed on our computer in this case I'm using Microsoft Office 2007 because we need to using Microsoft Excel object library services to uh, reference in our project now uh, let's add data grid view and then I need button okay this is data grid view one just rename to sort tiki view one like this okay this is for button let's just change the tag to import excel Like I said just now, we need to add Microsoft Excel object library as reference because we need using Microsoft Excel services. Just right click on the project, add reference. I want to search Excel object library. I will add Microsoft Excel 12.0 object library in here and then I will click OK. Okay, uh, now uh, let's try to code in here. Okay, double click in button and I'm using try in here because uh, this command is high risk error. So I recommend that you using try exception okay uh, you can see here you can show potential fixes and then import system data oldb just click like this okay And I want to declare open fi file dialog to find the location of our actual document. Open file dialog. I'm sorry. Dialog here as new. Open file dialog. Then uh, let's do make open file dialog to initial directory computers file system so while the open file dialog is uh, find the Excel document first will open in the document in our computers this is the path in 
here guys okay look me in here now uh, we need to filter the just uh, excel file will uh, show okay I want to using all files you can just uh, go with specified Excel but in here I want also uh, to show all file in the pad so any extension will showing and this is for Excel special Excel files okay and number second we can also doing with uh, xls files in other different or other extension for excel format okay this is for extension.xls this is for extension okay like this now uh, this is filter while the open file dialog is open guys If open file dialog that I'm sorry that show dialog this is me is equal to system okay if open file dialog dot show dialog dot me is equal to OK, it's mean the user click open or OK guys, and agree with the selected file. We need to declare some file information in here. As new I O dot file info. Okay, uh, this is for our connection to declare con equal to new ODDB connection. Okay, this is for provider. Provider equal to Microsoft. Twelve point zero and data source equal to Excel here. Okay, and then uh, for extended properties, extended. Excel 12.0 in here okay done in here
select asterisk from this mean all guys okay from this is the seed name in here is seed one okay no break it in here okay mistake here then just remove the good fill DTS it's comma in here for sheet one For data clip view one, uh, the data source equal to DTS, and for data clip view one, the data member is equal to C one here. Like this, and don't forget to close the connection and then uh, for exception is con no 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 sorry exit sub don't forget guys you can also adding con dot close uh, if there is nothing in here just exit sub okay it's better to declare this <laughs> not in try but you can do like this So you can close the connection if something error. Okay, let's try. Okay guys, you can see here. Let's uh, make one Excel file in the desktop. Let's call uh, data by news ENC, for example. Let's make uh, five data here. For example, this is number, web name, channel, Facebook. And then the last is, for example, just description like this. Okay. For example, this is uh, one, two, and then news ENC or E. B, C, or like this guys for different A1, B2 like this okay 
then for channel is for example hmm, news NG, YouTube Facebook news NG, Facebook description subscribe us okay I want to make number in here so uh, for example <laughs> this data it's dummy data <laughs> for our uh, experiment okay you can close uh, you can make the header is different color let's close this guys and let's try to import this into data grid view I hope this is not, nothing error <laughs> data by news gnc let's see like okay guys it's very nice okay if your uh, data grid view no auto size like this you can uh, auto size column to fill like this and then try again you can see like this Okay, and see here, guys, it works. If you want to docking using Anchor, you can do like this. For example, right, and then bottom. So your data grid view will more beautiful in here. Okay, just import Excel, go to desktop and data by new scenes okay uh, I think it's uh, enough how to uh, import data using uh, Excel to data grid view in Visual basic document okay uh, don't forget to subscribe I want to show also how to uh, inserting data grid view uh, item in my SQL and then how to export also <laughs> so it's very very uh, nice for you if you uh, know about this method okay uh, I think it's enough you can download this project in my website www.news.co.id slash web slash cv all project you can download here All project here okay uh, thanks for watching guys uh, I hope this helpful you bye bye